And here is one of those polling locations. This is a live look outside the Volusia County Supervisor of Elections Office where voters still have some time to cast their ballots. You can see the counter in the top part of the screen. Polls close in about an hour in Central Florida, so you still have time to get out. And as long as you are in line at 7 p.m., you will be able to vote tonight. And according to some of our local election leaders, thousands of votes have already been cast across Central Florida. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Stuart Moore. And I'm Summer Knowles. A number of high-profile races will help decide who serves in the Capitol on county commissions, school boards, along with many other local positions. Washington News Political Report Reporter Greg Fox is profiling some of the biggest races for state house and Senate. He kicks off our team coverage tonight and Greg, one Senate race in particular has featured some pretty nasty mailers. It really has. We've done a number of those stories. Yes, we We've have. done here. Get the facts among them. This Democratic primary in Osceola and Orange counties has a lot of familiar faces, making them easy targets. The candidates are state representative Kristen Arrington, former Congressman Alan Grayson and Carmen Torres, who is the wife of the outgoing state Senator Victor Torres. Senate District 25 covers all of Osceola County and part of South Orange County in the area near Walt Disney World. Carmen Torres appears to be the one taking the biggest beating in the mailers to voters. They try to portray her as an arm of the Republican Party and backed by lots of GOP money. We called these claims false in our Get the Facts report. Grayson has also been a target of mailers that bring up some of the more painful episodes in the breakup of his first marriage and called into question his investments when he was also serving in Congress. All three joined us for one of our exclusive West 2 News debates and talked about their accomplishments. Okay, well, uh, we've got a bit of trouble with that tape. We'll try to get that back to you. On the Republican side, school board member John Arguello is going up against Jose Martinez, owner of a local cell phone business in State Senate District 25. The winner of that contest will face the winner of the Democratic primary. All right, Greg, thank you so much.